Do you remember Ilfra Coom? I do. Happy family memories keep drawing me back. I bet a lot of you have memories of Ilfra Coom, so come with us and let's see what the place is like now. We'll take you for a lovely lunch and show you a controversial statue. Breezy out there, I would say. Down on the coast, it would be better. It's very really yeah. high up here. Let's get going. <laughs> We're down in Ilford Coombe this morning, and those buildings in the distance are known as Madonna's Bra. The scene today is very different from how I remember it when I used to come here with my family. Carol's father, John, took this photo of the Cardiff Queen steaming into Ilfracombe, and on board was Carol's grandparents. That's the grandparents on the left and Carol's mum on the right. And her dad, John, was taking the photo. Another one from the archive shows that back then Ilfracombe had a healthy fishing fleet. This is the landmark theatre and we've got some sort of fun fair on today which is playing loud music so I can't use this audio. Anyway we were checking to see what was on the theatre but nothing really took our fancy. The beach is a lot rockier than I remember but we used to play here for hours. We took the lovely path that skirts around the back of the headland to the harbour. The people in these flats have got a beautiful view, but I wonder what it's like when there's a storm. In the back streets we found this old shop and it looked like it's been there for years. How long it's been here? Years and years and years. It's still going though, isn't it? The groove in the wall is for the sea defences because a lot of water can be thrown over the wall when it's rough. Spider-Man's had enough. More sea defences. And it's really needed here because there's a little car park around the back, which would be very tempting to spend the night in. But uh, when that weather's rough, the sea absolutely pours over this harbour wall. Just down from that car park is the quay, which takes us down to the harbour. This is the heart of the tourist sector with your ice creams and trolley rides. This is where you'll leave from if you ever fancy a trip out to Lundy Island. In the distance you can see a green statue of a woman and it's called Verity. The artist is Damien Hurst and it was erected in 2012. Some people love it and some people hate it. What do you think? The harbour has changed over the years and it's now a more simple affair. We can see in the photo of John that it was much larger and went all the way round. This is where you catch the land train if that's your cup of tea. There's also a number of boat trips that you can do out to Lundy Island and also to spot wildlife and see the coastline. I remember one visit where we watched Air Sea Rescue practicing in this bay. Up on the hill is St Nicholas Chapel which dates back to 1321. Blowy, walking up here in it, at least it's helping us up the hill. Is it blowing us up? I think so. Let's go for this thing. Oh, that is good. Yeah. Here's the... We did go inside the church, but somehow the footage got lost. 
and all I've got is this single photo. It's time for some lunch, I think. Anything you fancy? Well, I went for the fish stew. And I think Carol went for the sea bass fillet. Those potatoes look delish, don't they? Mm. Are they new potatoes? Yes. Yeah. I think the table numbers are very smart. Thanks to a happy childhood, I have a deep love of this town. It all looks very similar, but of course it feels different now. If only we could recapture the feelings of our youth, then it would be perfection. If you have any fond memories of Ilfracombe, then please share them in the comments. We always like reading those. The light in that church has been guiding people into the harbour safely for hundreds of years and it still shines brightly today. I'm surprised that you can drive onto the sand in the harbour. Well, we really enjoyed our lunch and we took one last look around the shops before calling a taxi to take us back up to the Airbnb. Well we do hope you enjoyed the video and if you did please give us a like, hit that subscribe button and share us with your friends. We'll see you in the next one.